finally we get we actually get Deadpool in the MCU. I I didn't believe it was gonna happen. I thought it was just gonna be I thought it was gonna be Deadpool with X Men and the mutant and the mutants and that like sort of own universe in their own way. But in this article, link in the description, this is how Marvel plans to introduce Ryan Reynolds Deadpool to the Avengers. Ryan Reynolds Deadpool is about to about is about to become the newest member of the Avengers. Sources say that the Mark with the Mouth will finally become a part of the MCU after his transition from Fox to Marvel is complete. Introducing Deadpool would be a challenge. Though Marvel is already working on a way to bring him into the fold and their plan involves their friendly neighborhood Spider Man Tom Holland looking at you. Inside sources claim that Deadpool will be joining the Avengers on the next world saving mission. If this happens, we will see Deadpool teaming up with Black Panther, Captain Marvel, and Captain Am Captain America, plus any new Marvel superheroes any superheroes Marvel introduced by then. That also means that Deadpool will be introduced into the MCU before the next Avengers movie hits the big screens. According to We Got Discovered, Deadpool will be teaming up with Peter Parker and Spider-Man 3, details of which have not been revealed because Marvel just released Spider-Man Far From Home is unclear. When we will see Spider-Man next, all, apart from that, Deadpool is expected to be to make a few cameos across the MCU before he appears in the Avengers, which is very exciting. Yes! Oh my gosh! Will Deadpool change? With Disney taking away the franchise, there has been speculation that Ryan, eh, that Reynolds' character will get a bit of a makeover to get him ready for the MCU. After all, Deadpool is one of the few characters who will break the fourth wall. His first two solo out, out, out things also got a. R ratings, something that none of the other movies with the MCU have received. Fortunately, Inside Searcher says that Disney has no plans to change Ryan Reynolds' character. Good. Though fans might get a, a mildly version in the ensem assembled and said, instead, fans can expect that the same wacky and pulp. Politically incorrect character they have grown to love over the years. Exactly that how that fits into the Avengers, of course, it's not yet to be seen. But it will be interesting to watch him interact with our favorite superheroes. Marvel uncertain about Deadpool's future. Although it sounds like we've been seeing more of Deadpool in the near future, other sources say that Marvel is not sure how to introduce the character. Deadpool is, is different than any other character in the MCU, and there is no doubt that integrating him into the team will be a challenging task. There is the hurdle of introducing mutants into the MCU, a topic that has been ha, that has yet to be approached in the films. The good news is that Deadpool is a very popular fran franchise, and if Marvel does not want to do anything with the character, Disney will likely move forward with another solo movie. It would be disappointing if Deadpool does not appear in future Marvel projects, but at least fans would get to see Reynolds re reprise his role at least once more. Yeah, at least one more time. How will Marvel introduce mutants? With all Deadpool talk, fans are wondering how Marvel plans to incorporate the X-Men franchise into the MCU following the release of Spider-Man Far From Home. Marvel president Kevin Feige discussed Disney, uh, Disney's accountuous of X-Men and Deadpool and what it means about, what it means moving forward. Feige revealed that they have been thinking about ways to introduce the new characters into the MCU for quite some time and are happy to have access to all Marvel's characters once again. Feech did not tease any details about about how or when X-Men and Deadpool will be appear on the big screen, though they have expected to become a part of the Phase 4. That said, fans should not expect anything to happen for a few more years, especially since Fox just released Dark Phoenix. The fact that Dark Phoenix completely bombed at the box office could push a reboot date even further down the line. Reynolds ha has not commented on the rumors surrounding Deadpool's involvement into the MCU. His character's la latest adventure, Deadpool 2, was released in theaters in 2018. Spider Man Far From Home, meanwhile, is currently out in theaters. Ah. Uh, hmm. The. What I. What I think. It, it's go It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great to have. Oh, Reynolds character. Dude, if. 
if people are born to play roles, Ryan Reynolds, mm, he did an excellent job, including the first one. The first one and the second one, mm, <laughs> all his jokes just make me laugh. I love his character, but I still love Spider-Man, though. Spider-Man is number, my number one. Deadpool is number two. But, like, mm, having having Deadpool to interact with all the characters and everything, I'm I'm pretty excited. And if they can find a way to do it, great. I'm all full support for it. Excuse me. If they're going to reboot the X-Men, they got to either bring back Hugh Jackman or someone who could take up the claws again. That's just my only concern. But, yeah, let me know what you think down below in the comments. Uh, again, I will link the article down below about, uh, you know, Ryan Reynolds Steppel join, joining or introduce to the Avengers. Anyway... Uh, whatever. My name is Santa Goes to 239. Uh, have a wonderful day, morning, night, evening, sleeping, eating breakfast, whatever the occasion is. Uh, let me know your thoughts about this in the comments below. And yeah, my name is Santa Goes, and I can't know I'm saying my name. I'll see you.